Hello everybody and welcome back to SCP-3008 Lone Survivor, but you're not alone because there's loads of people in the bloody place and it's annoying. And there's been there's been updates again, as per usual. You can't stop these updates from flying out. Seriously, crazy. But this one's important because the forklift has been added. And you know how long I've been going on about the forklift? Forever. I want the forklift and it's finally here. Apparently it's not very good, but it's in. That's the main thing. I don't care if it's not any good. I just want to have a million forklifts. I have also noticed there is a bug in this uh, version. There's no music, but you won't notice that because I'm going to edit my music in. So you don't need to worry. You won't notice. It's pretty easy to fix in video. But for me, it's going to be dead silent, which is a bit annoying. But uh, that's fine. I can deal with it. But yeah, uh, this time we're just going to be doing the usual. Build the base. Well, not really. Get traps. Kill loads of staff. Hilarious. Check out the new changes. But mainly this update is just a load of AI small fixes. Stuff you don't really need to worry about. It's just a load of background stuff. But... That's fine, it's it's nice and easy. I I don't mind just playing it. It's fun, you know? Build something and just kill loads of things, it's hilarious. Also I've got tea. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this is what I can hear. Silence. Absolutely silent. But you'll be able to hear this lovely normal game music. So you won't even notice. Which is great. I mean, it's good for me as well because it means I can edit uh, sound effects a bit nicer. But it's just very, very quiet. I don't think it's even nighttime music. It's a weird bug. There's all, whenever there's updates, there's always weird bugs. Oh god, this is a rare find. Like how squished that wheel is. Also, can I use this to clip through things still? Nah, they seem to have fixed that. Okay, whatever. Uh, these, these are boring. These have been in forever. Forklift, on the other hand, has not, and is a lot cooler. There's two of them! We can build a base out of forklifts and pallet trucks. Oh, and uh, audio should be better in this video. I should sound actually like me. I, microphones don't do me justice, man. They make me sound less less cool. Post-edited me sounds cooler, alright? It's definitely not because I'm editing it to make myself sound cooler. I genuinely sound awesome. Right, here's the bad boy. Forklift son. Come on. Squeeze through. Lovely. Yeah. We have a thing that goes up and down. Whoa, lens flares, man. You, you go over there. We'll build... Um, over here somewhere, because I just noticed. Food. Noms. Yes, right. Let's pick those up. Save them for when we really need it. Is that it? That's it. Okay. That, that's chill. Oh, there's more here. Blind. Much. We'll um, start accumulating our forklifts wherever I parked it. I mean, it's pretty big, don't know how I'd lose it. How have I lost a forklift? How? How the hell did I do that? Okay, not to worry. We'll, we'll, we'll find some new ones. It's it's okay. Hell, I might even bump into it without realising. But what we're going to do now... Hello, but what we're going to do now is we're going to go scrap a load of stuff to get recipes and experience. And hell yeah. I've got a weapon. Okay, we're pretty much set. We just need to break a load of stuff now. We shouldn't take too long, and then we're just going to get the um, scrapping perks, the defensive perks, and just build loads of traps things. So I'm probably going to skip a humongous quantity of this video now, probably like a day or two, where I'm just going to scrap a load of stuff, get the recipes, and yeah. Shan't be too long. I mean, it's pretty quick to scrap all this anyway. I'll uh, jump to bits where I find recipes. Ob obviously. Oh, hell yeah. Flashlight. I'll have some of that. Okay, we got the extension cord. Completely accidentally. Uh, oh! Okay, right. Music just started working. <laughs> um, okay, it turns out I won't need to edit all the music in because it's just decided to kick in. Okay, I ain't complaining. This is nice, I can actually hear things now. It does also mean now that the music is way louder than the rest of the game. Okay, right. Uh, we're already starting with the mechat, the uh, scrapping things quicker because it's by far the easiest thing to do is to just scrap things to get the recipes. Attacking staff has risk of death. Breaking chairs has no risk at all and is safe. It's just very, very boring, all right? Also, we'll have infinite darts by the end of the video. Definitely not getting as many recipes. Uh, it's It's been a while and I've only got one recipe, and that's the extension cord. I mean, it's good, but you know, not as good as other things. We just have a lot of, um... We have a lot of material. Which is good. We also need to find somewhere to set up in a bit. I mean, I know day one is pretty low risk, but... 
Yeah, it's still, it's still nice to have somewhere. We might just sleep. We'll just surround a bed with some stuff just to confuse the staff enough so they don't bother us. It's also finding all these quick things to break. That saves time. And... Torch. Wait, torch is the thing you set on fire, isn't it? Old version of the flashlight. Yes. And then, I think... We need a lighter in your inventory to like, ignite the torch. Okay. Which means we need to get another recipe. Which also means we need to kill things or break things. Oh, that's the forklift! I knew a... Bugger. Uh, do you have a light? I thought this had like, um... Can I scrap the fork? Okay. Uh... Okay. I thought the... Forklift had like, front beams. But I don't know how you enable that. Uh, okay, right, I don't know how to do that. We'll just leave that, that's fine. I think we actually have the flashlight, so... There, you guys will appreciate this, you'll be able to see now. Question, can I have the flashlight when in the forklift? Shit, I've lost it again. Why can't I, I lose everything? Why is everything... I lose everything I like. Man, it's gone. Forklift sun. Yes, I can have the, f the flashlight in here and I can kind of wiggle it around. That's weird. Yeah, this was definitely rushed into development. It was this. <laughs> was this done because I wanted it? Probably. No one else was really wanting this, were they? Well, I had to see. Can it lift something? I know it can lift pallets, but surely it can lift, you know, garden furniture? Yes, of course you'll be able to lift garden furniture. Right, line her up. And. <laughs> Boo! Fork lift. Whoa, fuck me. Christ. Um, ooh. That's not good. Oh, that's okay. I have ungodly strength. I can flip it back over. Right, we're going to continue with our um, forklift fun after I've slept. Because uh, you can't see anything in the video. Neither can I, really. It's very dark. So let's just find a bed nearby. Lovely. And, uh, yeah, wait until morning. Nighty night. Oh no! Uh, okay, I forgot that food is a thing, and I nearly starved to death in my sleep, and I haven't saved. That would have been disaster. Uh, quick, eat, 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 consume. Fuck, that was close. That was. <sighs> Shit, man. Right, there are doors there. Very tempting, but we do have quite a bit of experience, so we're just gonna do the logical thing and get more stuff. First, scavenging. Okay, there we go. That looks godly. 40% faster or 6% faster as staff is nearby. Does that count corpses? Right, okay. Pick up, put it down so it's loose. I don't mind what bugged it out before. Get in. Lower. And pick up. There we go. Ooh, 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 ooh. Perfect. See? It does work. And I fixed it to the forklift. Can I, can I now move this? Okay, now it's made it float. Okay, that's fine. Um, this could be useful, actually, for positioning things above things. I don't know. Uh, we, we, we need food. Also, people kept commenting that I keep saying, uh, a lot, and I'm very aware that I do. You're probably going to notice a lot in this video as well, and that I've pointed it out. It's not my fault I do it, it's just habit. I don't know what to say, so I just go, uh, oh. Fuck. Drone. Fuck, I can't get through. It's alright, it, it, it crashed into a wall. <laughs> alright, steady. Huh. No. Eh. Shit. Is there a quick way around? Okay, can I still... Reap the rewards of this if I hit it with something. Yes, it does. <laughs> if it crashes into a wall, just smack it with an axe and boom, rewards. Oh god, god, these take these tables are the nightmares of scrap. I just had the craziest idea. What if I try to lift up a forklift with a forklift? Such science hasn't been done before, and we don't know what the results are going to be. Now, it's going to be quite easy, because there's one there, and there's one here. You're coming with me, forklift number two. Let's just position ourselves a bit more adequately to get out of this little corner. Steady. 
Okay, right, there we go. There you go. Right, ramming speeds. Go. Hopefully the, the model's the right size to get under. Right, there we are. And lift. Ooh. Okay. Sort of. We need to weigh it down a bit more. Or it might be because it's carrying this. Right, you get out of here. Okay, yeah, I think this is doable. Hang on. No, no, I just flipped it over. Don't worry, I can fix this. I have a forklift. Ugh. Boom. Masterpiece. Absolutely gorgeous. Way. Okay. There are going to be some really interesting glitches to perform with these bad boys. Right, we seriously need food though. I, uh, I'm not looking after myself at all. Staff? More like, I'm going to have to kill you. Because it's really funny that... Lots of you come over when you're dead, so... Ooh. Okay, dead. Get fucked. Quick foot. Cool. We need to run around and find food. Why do I never find cafeterias? It's not fair. Okay, food department. Lush. Let's get some of the noms. Lots of pasta. Here's some more. Like it. And we're full. Lovely. And there's some spares. Bring that with. And now we're going to go all the way back to the forklifts. Shame forklifts are incredibly slow as well. Actually, I think I'm going to kill this guy. Ow. That was my feelings, you ass. Okay, we're lost again. Well, I say lost, we never really had a place to call home, did we? Really? Hello. I think I should start building a corpse pile. And, uh... There you go. Metal spikes! Nice! This is going to be my corpse pile here, I think. Because all the staff are going to start. Yes, there's loads coming now. Lovely. The more corpses, the better. Because now, hopefully the staff will uh, start coming over here, trampling on the spikes, and then they'll die, because they're stupid. Don't tell them I said that, though, because they'll try and kill me. Okay, the bodies are getting in the way a little bit, but that's fine. The, the, the spike trap is going brilliantly. So now, hopefully, walk into my death pit. No. No, wrong way. Oh, fucking ass. Come back. That's fine. I'll, I'll throw spikes here. Not, not the actual spikes, the darts. They got spikes on them. You. This way, go on. I need to test my death pit. Through here, come on. You didn't take any damage. Right, okay, that's fair. There you go. See, wasn't that easy? Just walk over them and perish, bitch. Shit, look at all that experience. God damn it, I keep forgetting. Get scrap attack, because now we can get more stuff from breaking things. Because that's our primary way of getting things, is by breaking stuff to get the recipes. If we get wooden spikes, we're set. Because we could just, the entire area just spikes by episode two. Because I, he needs to slow down with the update so I can actually do more than, you know, two episodes of a, ep, you know, of a series. Just wait for the Steam release, okay? Then then it'll update by itself and you can have compatible saves. And if you can transfer saves to newer versions, it's just normally it doesn't work. So, I have tried, trust me. Normally something breaks. Mate, there are so many dead people, you should really go and have a look. Yeah, that's right, go, go over there. There you go. See? Wasn't that easy. And these sofas are conveniently good for walking. Whoa! This would have been useful if it was dark. Now you can start seeing. Oh, don't get too close because they, they get angry at you if you get too close. You can see how quickly this starts getting basically an XP grinder because of the way the staff are attracted to other staff. Yes, yes, plenty of room. Join us. Shame they don't drop many recipes. Oh yeah, I forgot to ask the... Uh, compulsory weird question of every video. Last week I asked you, what, what, how long do you brew your tea for? And the consensus was either about five to ten minutes, or I don't drink tea, I drink coffee because I'm American. And it's like, you're not very good at playing along with the joke, are you? Excuse me, excuse me, I was having a conversation with my vol viewers. Door is now closed. Please leave the building. Yeah, yeah, I'll fucking leave you in the ground in a minute. Get fucked. Short circuit trap. Oh, that's gonna be really overpowered. Oh, they're going to regret being alive, plus there's power here. This is literally perfect. So I just get the extension cord, and then, basically, thread like that there, and then put one like, oh god, that's really, <laughs> extension cords move staff bodies easier than picking them up. 
This will do that. And then you get your short circuit trap. And boom. And that does so much damage. Oh, this is going to be fun. These videos have literally just evolved into Battle Forge does something funny for the fast first 10 minutes and then just builds a death trap for the haha -ha jokes, mate. I'm so glad he's moved the key binding for throw from, I think it used to be H to T. That makes less finger movement. Okay, right. It's dark, as you can see. Uh, we're just going to go to bed. I think we've got enough hunger to last us through the night. Nobody's these, have these beds got power cables? Power cord? No. Uh, we're going to have to sort that out. Simple extension cord job. Right. Sleepy sleep. Just realised I never asked the funny question, did I? <laughs> I got distracted. Oh, for fuck's sake, we're starving again. Stop getting distracted. What is your guy's favourite SCP? My favourite SCP is currently 3008, if you haven't noticed. I love it. I want more stories about it. So yeah, that was, that was, that was my question. What's your favourite SCP? Put it in the comments. Best comment might get shown in this video. Probably. Next video, I mean. Can't show it in this video because it's now. Okay, we've got maximum scrapping speed. It's 40% faster. Or 60% when there's staff nearby. I don't know what the requirements for that are. Right, this is close. Do I scrap faster? Hell yeah. Damn, that's fast. Right, it's good to have staff nearby for now. Go on, stay with me, man. I need your scrapping speed. Or I could... No, he's going to go over to the death pit. Mate, don't do it. No, he's seen it. No, don't do it. Ah, oh. right, we're gonna make a quick run for some food. Uh, we'll try just doing straight lines because that's the safest thing to do. We've got fasting, so we don't get as hungry as fast because we're gonna need it because there's barely any food anywhere ever. Because look at here, there was two bits of food in two kitchen departments. Wow, amazing. That's not gonna last us. Do I have to venture further? I don't want to do that, I get lost. I really should have set my render distance for a bit further as well. It's on far, but that's not very far, believe it or not. Oh, you got the light bulb. We can make um, a flashlight now, which is not useful at all, actually. Oh. <laughs> uh, I heard something die. Yep. Well done. Congratulations, you're now part of the death pit. Yes, yeah, nice big pile. Lovely. Oh, bloody hell, that was a good time to turn around, just launched away. So yeah, this is the XP grinder now. You just kind of leave it, and it builds up every time. You just got to maintain the spikes, which is easy, as long as you find enough metal. But our main concern is food still. Okay, I don't think I've actually been this way yet. So we went north last time. I'm guessing that's north. We're going to go south from the base this time. No, we're not. There's a wall. Oh, wait, someone died here? We'll be taking him back to the pile. He's probably distracting them from killing themselves. We're still so... We need to start upgrading the um, hunger perks. Starving is bad. Right, now we got a little friend here. Let's just yeet you over there. And uh, these guys were a little bit untidy. There we go. You know what? I want to ram a forklift through these guys. I'm not fucking mental. They just hit when I was dying. Hello? Oh. Yeah, you're fresh. In the pile you go. Ow. Ow. There we go. Right. Ramming speed. That was uneventful. Uh, the reason I bailed was because I was pretty sure I'll take damage. So I was going to save because I'm clever like that. Right, try again. Sorry, the brightness and the blooming is going to go mental for a second. So here we go. Yep, taking damage. Can I just scoop a load up? There's just so many things I want to try with this thing now. No, that's definitely not working. Go on. Push. Push and lift. Nah, that doesn't work. Okay, that's fine. Fork left is... You're useless, mate. Tell you what, though, you're going to make a great thumbnail. Right, I think I was going to call it quits this video. I really hope you've enjoyed it so far. Uh, we'll probably do this one again back to back because there's a few things I wanted to try. Uh, I did want to build a, basically like this trap, I wanted to build a base over the top of it so I can live above it and let's just fill it with food, have somewhere I can easily sleep nearby and just absolutely bean staff. I want to eventually do a series where I get every upgrade, 100% of the game basically. But yeah, this has been a good look at the update. You got the new forklift, the new staff stuff, the AI, the... It, there's just a lot of different things that have come now. But yeah, 
I really hope you've enjoyed. If you want to support the game, there's a link in the description for that. And if you want a slightly older version for free, that's also available. The new full version will be out soon. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you really soon for another episode of SCP-3008 Lone Survivor. Toodaloos! Also, I really hope you enjoyed the music and the audio quality, because that should all be better now. Thanks, bye!